So I'm Heidi Fraser Kraus and I'm the Head of IT Services at the University of York. It's extremely difficult to get a full picture of all the costs associated with any aspect of an IT service. Actually a data centre service because it's contained is maybe a little bit easier, um, but things like power, infrastructure costs etc really do make it very tricky and there's all sorts of layers to it so the level of granularity also depends. Well, I think the most surprising thing was some of the services that we did run, you know, discovering services that ran in the data centre. Um, I mean, that sounds a dreadful thing to say, but universities are complex things and have had legacy things running for a very long time. So I think that, you know, the surprising bit is what you actually have there in your data centre, what things, you know, have been running away and chuntering away for years and nobody's ever really checked that they're being used for anything useful. Um, so I think that's the most surprising and difficult bit and I'm pretty sure you could go and ask anybody that same question and if they're being truthful they'll tell you the same thing. So I don't think York is being particularly uh, different or difficult in that regard. I mean I think that's one of the, the interesting things is that it wasn't anything I could go and pick off the shelf and say apply this and it'll give you a cost for X, Y and Z. And I think that's what the sector needs. It needs a sort of standard approach to, you know, what are services, what, you know, what do you count in service provision? And some of the things I asked, you know, said as challenges in my talk were around how do you allocate cost to particular services? You know, how do you decide how much of network cost should go to particular services? So I think that what's missing in the sector is a sort of standard and common approach um, and thinking, almost giving you a checklist or a model um, to work through um, that will, you know, where do you start? You know, because w we, we started with a common sense approach. I'm sure there were better ways of doing it, <laughs> but, you know, you have to start somewhere. <laughs>